Hello, my dear students. Hello, hello. Hello, Hazel. Hello, Elmer. Miss Dave Heido, welcome to your class. Mr. Gustavo, welcome. Hello. Hi, it's a pleasure to have you here in another class. Thank you. Welcome to class number 10. Good evening, teacher. Hi, how are you? I'm very it's, well. It's a great pleasure to have you here. Thank you. Me too. How was your day? ¿Qué tal fue el día? ¿Cómo estuvo el día? Uh, very heavy. Very heavy. Why? Uh, I was working all day. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, it's like <clears throat> a lot of things to do, I imagine. Yeah. Okay, you were working the whole day. Mr. Haido, welcome. We missed you yesterday. Yes. Thank you, teacher. Yeah. Todos estaban llorando. No está. Me tocó trabajo muy pesado. I imagine, I imagine. Aquí todos querían hacer fiesta y dije, no, porque no vino Jairo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mr. Gustavo, how was your day? Fine. I was a, no, I had a normal day. You had a normal day. It was not that heavy. Go to conference. Three emails. Uh, all the day with Very conference. Oh my Jairo God. Is, my, is my partner at the office. Oh, really? Uh -huh. Jairo and Mario. Mario. Aha, uh -huh. son los partners in crime. Ya veo, yeah. ya veo cuando se me pierde uno, donde ir a buscar a los demás. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. <laughs> so you work in the same place. Yes. Hey, yes, that's, we did. that's fantastic. How nice. How nice that you work in the same place. That's very beautiful. Because, well, you see each other. You see each other during the day and at night. <laughs> <laughs> no, Only because, at night. Because, Only we, night see, because we work at home. Oh, you do home office. Yes. Oh, that's why. Well, that's good that you can see at least at night. You can see yourselves at night. Well, today we are going to start working. Thank you very much for the audios. I have a couple of comments about the audios because I sent you the examples. Les envié los ejemplos, tipo. <laughs> I sent you the examples of the pronunciation and we had some difficulties at the moment of reading the example, but uh, I am going to just go over some of them and I'm going to send you the comments that I have about uh, about the different pronunciation. One of the most common problems that you had about, for example, uh, Carlos Ruiz, and that was a very common mistake, when you say he is a busy man. No, he's a busy man, right? He's a busy man. Many of you said busy, he's a busy man. No, he's a busy man in the case of Carlos Reeds. He plans lessons, grades. It's not homework, it's homework. He helps with after school activities. And of course he teaches, right? His salary isn't great, but that's okay. His students like his class. And the problem with Becky Peck, the most common that I listened was rain or shine. Rain or shine is like llueve o esté soleado, ella sale a trabajar. And hours, the word hours. You say hours, no, it's hours, many hours. And the pronunciation of professional, professional, okay? Now I invite you to listen to your audio again and say like, hey, yo era el ejemplo, oh my God. <laughs> It happens, right? It happens in some cases. It's like, como la gente puede andar diciendo profesional. It's like, oh, it was me. <laughs> It's professional. Yes, I know. Porque cuando uno hace una lectura silenciosa, por ejemplo, por ejemplo, en mi caso, yo en una lectura silenciosa, 
sí pronuncio bien todas las palabras con la entonación, pero cuando ya la estoy haciendo una lectura ya en, en altavoz, por así decirlo, siempre hay palabritas así que cabal, uno se come una entonación aquí, otra entonación allá. Yeah. ¿Por qué? Because, because read and think. Uh, yeah, when you think, in some cases, you know and you remember the pronunciation. And that's why one of the tips that I always give my students is that take a book in English, right? I have many books in English, right? Yo quisiera tenerlos aquí cerquita y llevárselos a todos. Eh, take a book in English, any book in English, or look for articles online and read aloud, read aloud. Eh, in YouTube, there are some sites, and I'm going to share it, en YouTube hay un sitio donde van las lecturas y se las leen. Y entonces usted lo que tiene que hacer es leerlas otra vez después de escuchar la pronunciación. Porque en mi cabeza, y hay un, hay un meme bien chistoso, ¿verdad? saquen el inglés de mi cabeza y pónganlo en mi boca. <risa> <risa> y es el caso de... Perfecto. And it happens with every single level. It happens with every level. A veces en el bujo, en la calle, o a veces si estoy esperando algo en algún restaurante, la gente se me queda viendo porque yo leo en voz alta. Y dicen así como, me guía esta bicha, porque está leyendo está en voz loca. alta. Está loca. Está loca, dicen, ¿qué onda? Pero no leo duro, ¿ves? pero leo en voz alta. Pero es por eso. ¿Por qué? Porque eso es lo que le ayuda a mejorar su pronunciación. Aquí no sale, pero chivísimo. O sea, qué bonito mi inglés. And then when you speak, it's like... Oops. And even I, with, se me, se me oh, entiende bien. Ajá, eso, yo me entiendo bien. Pero sí, es, y es una muy buena práctica. Uh, leer en voz alta es una muy buena práctica. Así que cuando lo vean, hay que le digan también, ve, hey, esté loco. <risa> Pero es, sirve mucho. Le voy a pasar los links de la página de YouTube donde, eh, sí. donde pueden practicar lectura en voz alta. It's very good. It's very, very, very good for your English. And it takes out the fear. Se les quita el miedo a que la gente los oiga hablar. Yeah, definitely. Because that's the worst fear. Y por eso uno se traba al hablar. Because you feel afraid. Like, they are going to listen to me and they are going to say that I am making a mistake. Nah, it doesn't matter. Right? But that is the problem. And that's why I use these exercises. Por eso les pongo esos ejercicios. Para que se den cuenta cómo es que leemos en realidad. <laughs> And then I invite you to go and listen to your audios. I invite you to check your audios and I, I invite you to check on the mistakes that uh, you did with the audio. So the part that we have about Becky Peck, it says Becky Peck walks in the street every day for many hours, rain or shine. Becky is a professional dog walker. She walks dogs for other people. Sometimes she takes 20 dogs to the park at one time. In Carlos Ruiz, Carlos Ruiz is a busy man. He plans lessons, grades homework, helps with after school activities, and of course, he teaches. His salary isn't great, but that's okay. His students like his class, so he is very happy. So he, it's like the, uh, that's from Carlos Ruiz. And, <laughs> So it is very necessary that you go and check your audios, right? Si no, vean otra vez la grabación de esta clase y comparen su audio con lo que les acabo de leer. It is very necessary. O ahí se los envié igual para que lo vean. Today, we are going to talk about a very delicious topic. We are going to talk about food. We are going ah. to talk about food. <laughs> It's like, oh, I'm 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 <laughs> Right, we are going to talk about food, the different vocabulary related to food, and the different uh, uh, parts or types of food that we have. So today it's going to be for a lot of vocabulary, right? We're going to have a lot of vocabulary. Uy, ¿qué pasó? Me trae. Here I go. Me avisan cuando me destra. <laughs> no, lo vemos. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, great. Let me open my presentation, right? Remember, here, I am going to share it for everybody. De repente se pone renuente esta cosa. Es la señal, Sí, culpa de mis amigos. 
No voy a decir los nombres, pero usted ya los conoce. Los mismos. Los mismos. Yes. Unos que empiezan con T y terminan con Go. Practice your English as much as possible. Ask for help whenever you need. Keep your cameras on. Attend your sessions. Participate. Cooperate with your friends and collaborate in the WhatsApp group. It is very important. We did the review of yesterday, right? We did the review of the professions and occupations. And today we are going to talk about food. And I have two questions for the class. Can you cook? Yes or no? Can you cook? No, only eggs. I don't. <laughs> only eggs. Well, but eggs, you survive. Egg it's cooking. Sandwich. Yes, yes. Cereal. <laughs> Maruchal soup, maruchal soup, cereal, Maru <laughs> sandwich, cornflakes, ducky soup, coffee, <laughs> yes. uh, we, we coffee, were, <laughs> coffee. Well, but you can have a complete breakfast. You can have a yes. sandwich, yes. coffee, a little bit of fruit, cereal, cereal, right? Yeah. And for lunch, a sandwich and a soup, right? Well, and well, eggs. I, I, I survive. <laughs> the I survive with that. <laughs> You survive. Hey, Luis. El agua se le quema. Come on. <laughs> so, eh, the next question. What is your favorite restaurant? What is your favorite restaurant? Mexican food, Italian food, eh, Salvadorian. What is your favorite La restaurant? La Calaca is very nice. It's a Mexican restaurant. Yeah. And it's very delicious. <laughs> But it's a little bit expensive. Yeah. China wall is delicious. China wall. China wall. China wall. <laughs> China wall. Okay. Chinese food. Good. Let me see. What is your favorite restaurant? Tell me. <laughs> favorite restaurant? Look at Hyro. Thank you. Huh. What is your favorite restaurant? I don't know because. Aliches. Caliche, <laughs> Punto Marina. Caliche, Punto Marino, Puerto Marico. Maya. La curva. La playa, la playa 503. Oh my God. Este, ¿Qué otra? Oh, no, sé, no sé cómo decir. Ok, de Comedor de al lado. De la hola, hola el, el Neptuno, el, el, oh venado, my God. el venado. No. Okay. <laughs> you see, you see, I, I just throw the stone and they fall, and they fall by themselves, right? Yo solo puse el anzuelito así, mire, y todos cayeron. Well, sorry, <laughs> teacher. Uh -huh. Sorry, teacher. Yeah. Gracias. Los que no saben es que sus esposas me pagaron para sacar esta información. <risa> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. So, all the seafood restaurants. Ya, ya sabes, pero no le gusta ir. Ah, ya. So, it's like, ¿a oh, vos no te gustan los mariscos? Dice, bye. <risa> Good. So, you like the seafood restaurants. Mr. Gustavo, do you agree with all the restaurants that Jairo mentioned? Yes, the same places. <laughs> the same places. Good. And Miss Kayla, what is your favorite restaurant? Kaylita. Yo por los tacos. Yeah. <laughs> she's, she's near a very popular place around Masferrer. <laughs> Getting uh, some tacos. <laughs> uh, mm. In front. <laughs> Mm. It's like from the, it's from mm. the famous place. Uh, well, I, I don't remember the name of the place. <laughs> I don't know if you have visited before. Mm. Of the, uh, body. <laughs> exactly. So, the favorite restaurant. What is your favorite restaurant? And for sure, the first question was Can you cook? And that is very necessary because, I mean, you need to survive in some way for you to uh, eat properly, right? And here about the different things that we can eat, the food pyramid recommends that you have to eat very little of these 
category, we have different categories in the food pyramid. For example, here, we have this one that it's supposed that we need to eat very little of this one, a good quantity of this ones, a good quantity of dairy meal or dairy uh, food. And here we have in the oils, fats, oils, and sugars, las grasas, we have cream, candy, butter, oil, and potato chips, right? Potato Eat. chips. A veces le dan vuelta a la pirámide, ¿verdad? pero no es correcto. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, no, but this is my biggest category. No, no, no. Here you have fish, the most yeah. popular in El Salvador, beans, <laughs> nuts, chicken, nope. chicken, eggs, and beef. Eggs. Beef. Here in El Salvador, I think we can have anything, but beans, we always beans have. And eggs. Beans and eggs, right? Beans and eggs, you can be beans missing forever. anything, right? Beans and eggs are... Oh, uh, be beans and forever. cheese. Beans and chicken, right? Beans go with everything. Cheese. Yo creo que si tiene frijoles, va con pollo, con pescado, con carne, con huevo, con anything. Con queso. <laughs> con queso, con crema. Only the beans with avocado, right? The soup, the beans soup, right? It's very popular here in our country. For the daily milk, we have milk, yogurt, and cheese, right? Cheese. It's not chess, okay? It's cheese. cheese. Yogurt and milk, right? Yogurt. yogurt, yogurt, and milk. And for sure, we have the next category yogurt. here. Yogurt. Uh, yogurt. The oh, most yeah. the most popular part, the vegetables. Do you like vegetable students? Yes. Yes, they say. Yes. All. All yes. the vegetables. Yes. All. Yes. Mm -hmm. All vegetables. All the vegetables. Broccoli? Yes. I like. I like, like broccoli. I like broccoli with lemon. It's very delicious. Let's see. L carrots? Yes. With, like. with yeah. lemon. Wine. Yeah. I like. With wine. Or wine. with wings. Mm -hmm. With ah, wings. With wings. <laughs> I said with wine. I said zanahoria con vino. Wine con vino. Que boca trata esto. O sea, yo he comido, yo he comido hojas de jocote, pero... Al extremo. <laughs> yo dije, qué elegante, dije. Carrots <laughs> with wine. <laughs> Lettuce. <laughs> Lemon, they are very good. With wings. All, with all, wings. all about this. Yes. <laughs> Lettuce. Just, just I, I had berenjenas. <laughs> Eggplant. Uh, we're going to check that one. Okay, tengo una colección ahí de vocabulario okay. que ya van a ver que ni se van a imaginar. Potatoes. Potatoes are the most Potatoes. famous vegetable in El Salvador. Si la nutricionista me dijo que comiera vegetales, but only potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> only potatoes. Potatoes with meat, potatoes with chicken, fried potatoes, potatoes with cream. Eh, que comiera vegetales, pero era papita frita. <laughs> ah, exactly. <laughs> eh, vegetales. <laughs> And you have the fruits, right? Bananas oranges, strawberries, right? Okay. Strawberry. It's not a strawberries, right? No, strawberries. strawberries. No, strawberries. 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 Apples oh. is not oh. apple, okay? Oh. It's apples. And apples. for sure, mangoes, right? Mangoes. mangoes. Mm. Here we use it for the fruit and for the handsome boys. Mangoes. <laughs> and here we have Bread, cereal, crackers. Crackers are galletas saladas, right? Crackers. Rice. Rice, noodles, videos, mm -hmm. right? And pasta. Noodles and pasta. Noodles no are videos. Noodles. Noodles and pasta. And in here, I am going to show you my friend, the vocabulary. Here I have a really big compilation of different types of vocabulary related to 
the food. Don't worry about copying this because I'm going to send you the document. Yo le voy, enviar el, le voy a enviar el documento para que no se preocupen en copiar todo. Here you have the fruits. You have peaches. Do you know what's the meaning of peaches? Yes. What is it? Duranos. Duranos, right? What about quinces? I don't know. No. Ah, membrillos. Bueno. <laughs> I don't know. Pero lo he visto. Okay, let me look for a, let, Okay, we are going to do a, a Google research. Can you look for one picture in Google and send it to the group about membrillo? Vamos a ver quién es el primero en que le envíe. Go and look for in Google about membrillos, the fruit, and send it to the group. Si yo lo envío a alguien, ya no lo envíe, okay? Chan, 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 Aha. Go to Google and look for membrillos. Oh, he said, oh. Send it to the group. If you find it, send it to the group. And you know, it is very common in the traditional uh, celebrations in our country. They make a little jelly. Hacen como una jaleita y lo ponen en unos botecitos. Una jaleita roja. No sé si la han visto. Que tiene como una paletita. Es un dulce típico. That's membrillo. Mm -hmm. Ajá. Hey, did you send the membrillo in the group? Nadie me ha enviado la foto del membrillo del grupo. Está cargando el WhatsApp. Ay, my God. <laughs> Okay, so look, look for them. It's the quinces. Nectarines, nectarines are, as the name suggests, nectarinas. Nectarinas is a type of uh, peach. Es un tipo de durazno. The nectarines. There you have the membrillos. Thank you, Mario, for the membrillos. Cherries, do you know what's the meaning of cherries? Teresa. Teresa. Apricot? Melocotón. No Melocotón. Apricot. Apricots. 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 The next one. Eh, plums. Do you know what the meaning of plums? Uh huh. Do you know what the meaning of plums? Plums are very necessary when you have problems to go to the restroom. Ciruela, ciruela. The ciruela. Ciruela. <laughs> you see, you got the idea. You got the reference. Todos de más de 25 entienden la referencia. The plums. <laughs> so, plums, ciruelas. Figs. What is figs? What is figs? Eagles. Eagles, right? Eagles. Do you like figs? Yeah. yeah. Yes, they are very delicious. Oh, no, no. You don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Orange. Orange is the same thing as the color, right? Orange. And it Naranja. is very delicious. Naranja. Tangerine yeah. is similar to the orange, but you can eat it in little slices. Mandarina. Mandarina. Good. Lemon. Lemon is lemon, right? You know what lemon is? I don't know what is. <laughs> what is lemon? Oh my God, I don't know. The lemon. <laughs> The golden apple is the yellow apple, right? Golden apple are the yellow apples. Mango is mango, right? Lychee is very, it's very Amor similar. <laughs> it's, the, it's the representation of COVID, right? <laughs> the lychee. <laughs> Mame is the same, right? Mame, tamarind is the same Amor. thing as in Spanish. Okay. Apple, avocado, it's considered a fruit, right? Avocado. Uh, banana, avocado is aguacate, right? Banana, blueberry and blackberry. Do you know what <laughs> blueberry and blackberry are? And it's not the phone, okay? <laughs> what is black, blackberry and what is blueberry? Arandano. Yeah, for sure, but they are, blueberry, what is the name? Arandano, arandanos. Arandanos, right? Arandanos. Yeah. Carrot, that it's also considered a fruit, right? Carrot. Wave is guayaba. Wave, guayaba. Grapes, Wait. Wait. kiwi, kiwi, right? 
לים? קנטלופ אנג מלון. קנטלופ. קנטלופ אנג מלון זה אותו דבר. מלון. קנטלופ אנג מלון זה אותו דבר. פאפאיה זה פאפאיה. אתה אוהב את פאפאיה? Yeah, yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah, papaya. It's very good. Yes. This, the smell is not very nice, but the flavor is good. No. It's <laughs> okay. The next one, pear. Pera. Pear. Pera. Pineapple. Pera. Or pineapple, Pera. right? You have the two. Piña. Strawberry. Tomato. Pera. And Pera. cashew seal. Do you know what it's a cashew seal? Well, I added here, but this is not a fruit. Cashew is the fruit, right? Cashew, marañón, right? And if I said cashew seed is semilla de marañón, that it's also considered a very delicious uh, uh, snack, right? It's the cashew seed. Here we have also the most uh, delicious fruit for your teacher, mom beans. Mom beans are very popular nowadays. They are called cocotes. Mm. I love mom beans. It's my favorite fruit, right? Si de repente se les atraviesa ahí un aguacalada de cocotes, acuérdense de su aceite. Y se la trae. Mom beans, mom beans. The next one, watermelon. It's also another very delicious fruit. What is the meaning of watermelon? Sandia. Sandia, right? Coconut? Coco. 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 And grapefruit? Uva. Grapefruit. What is the meaning of grapefruit? Cocktail de fruta? No. Grapefruit. Toronja. Mm -hmm. Toronja. Grapefruit. Here we go with the vegetables. What are the names of the vegetables that we have? Tomato, you know mm. tomato, right? Potato. Please don't do this. No le pongan e a tomato porque no lleva ni a potato. Please. Watercress. Do you know what's the meaning of watercress? Berros. Berros. Exactly like that, right? Yes. Berros. <laughs> Berros. Hay algunos panes rellenos que son más berros que pan. Y pan. <risa> rellenos de berro. <risa> ¿Me puede dar más pollo para mi berro, por favor? <risa> The next one is say mushroom. Mushroom is hongos, hongos. right? Champiñones. Carrot, it's also considered a vegetable. Lettuce. Cabbage. Cabbage is repollo. It's not red chicken, okay? Please, in the love of God, it's not red chicken. It's cabbage, right? Cabbage. Onion. Do you like onion? Ah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Depends. Depends. Right? <laughs> yeah, it's very good. Garlic. Ajos. Do you like garlic? Depends. Depending. Depending. En que venga. Yeah. Nuestros so, frijoles. Uh, yeah. frijoles, no. No, the, the <laughs> problem. Ah, uh, yeah, in the garlic bread, yes. Depends. But what happens when you are drinking or when you are taking chicken soup? Yes. When you are taking yes. chicken soup and you think, oh, a piece of potato, and it's a garlic. <laughs> no. Yeah. Right, it's really horrible. Garlic, pumpkin. Calabaza. Calabaza. Oh, ay ayote, ayote, ayote here in El Salvador. Chili, chili is the spicy one. When you oh. take it, it's like, eh, it's oh my God, it's very hot. Chili. Green, chili pepper. Okay, uh -huh, it's chili pepper. Green pepper and red pepper are the ones that you use for cooking, right? Chile verde, chile rojo, chile amarillo are the ones that you use for cooking. Broccoli. It's your friend, right? That you like with lemon. Spinach. Pinaco. Pinaco. Squash. Pinaco. I like I like squash with cream. Pipiang, right? Pipiang. Mm. Yeah, pipiang. No es para hacer chiste, okay? 
Squash <laughs> with cream. It's the vegetable. Hi. <laughs> Hey, come on. Asparagus. 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 Peas, guisantes. Right? Peas. Los verdecitos, guisantes. Oh. Or you call them petit pois. Petit pois. <laughs> beans, beans, right? Frijolitos. Frijolitos. Eggplant, berenjena. Who, is, who hates berenjena here? I like. I hate. No. Ah, Mario. Mario. I like. Don't like. With cheese. With cheese. A mí no me gustaban también, pero una vez la probé en un restaurante de comida china. Uy, no. Ay, qué nice. Okay. Qué sentimiento. Ya, yo creo que es un Lo llevó el momento de de cuando los probó. Okay. And it is very delicious with peanut butter. Have you tried celery with peanut butter? ¿Ya han comido apio con mantequilla de maní? No. no. I don't like that peanut butter. Yeah. You don't like the peanut butter. Oh my God. It is very no. delicious. Who is the peanut butter? I, what is Mante the peanut oh butter? Mantequilla. Okay, man, eh? Mantequilla okay, de maní. It is very delicious. It's something yes. very delicious. Oh, yeah, exactly. And the celery with peanut butter, it's really delicious. Also, the carrot with peanut butter is good. And the celery with jelly. También con jalea. It's very good. I recommend it. Pan tostado con jalea y... Y como se llama? Peanut butter. Yeah. Uh -huh. Crema. Yeah, en queso crema. <laughs> yeah. Well, well the, the bread with, with cream cheese, yes. Yeah, that's very good. So here we go with our first friend and enemy, the fast food. Hamburgers, <laughs> sandwiches, no. hot dogs. No. And let me see, we go here with pizza, pizza french fries, Tacos, nachos, burritos, and pancakes. I don't have to explain all this because we know the meaning. The only one, maybe the French fries. French fries are papitas. And then we have tacos, nachos, burritos, and pancakes that are the most common ones. Snacks. Snacks are the ones that we eat between the food, between Bocadillos. breakfast and lunch. Yes, right? Bocadillos. And here we have donuts. Cake, milkshake, tea, coffee. Well, coffee is with the food and with the snack and after the snack and all, all, the, all the time. All the time. All the time. Yes. Hasta la cena. And the best friend, the best friend of coffee, sweet bread, sweet bread. right? Oh, I think they are bread. married. Coffee <laughs> yeah. and sweet bread. You know, I am very strange because I don't like to put the bread in the coffee. I don't like it. And there are some people who put the bread there. It's like, whoosh, 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 whoosh. <laughs> I cannot do it. I cannot do it. I don't know why, but I cannot do it. No me gusta el sabor que agarre el café con la grasa del pan. Oh, and it's like, <laughs> I don't like it. And uh, it is funny because my, my kid loves to do that. And I am like, no, my coffee. <laughs> and he's like, mama, préstame tu café. And I'm like, no. <laughs> yeah, so the sweet bread and the coffee. Here we also have another type of a snack that we have the lollipops and the popsicles. Do you know the meaning of lollipop? Yes. What is it? Es la, la, ¿cómo se llama? Paletas. Paletas de dulce, exactly like that. And popsicle are paleta de helado. Oh, 
O paletas, Pero, ah, o paletas de hielo, right? Popsicle. Ok, ice cream, for sure, ice cream, right? Do you like mm. ice cream? Uh, yes, I like. You like yeah. ice cream? Yes, I, I like ice cream. Much. Really. Really like. <laughs> Not much. I don't like ice cream. Yes? I don't. <laughs> soda? Do you sure. like soda? Yes, Angelique? Yes. Uh, yeah. What is the reference um, in Spanish? de sorbete con eh, nieve. Ah, so it's the same. que no tiene leche. Okay, in right. English it's the same, ice cream. Ice cream, ice cream. Uh, well, in this case, uh, we can have, um, what is the name of the other thing? Ah, let me remember the name. I have the name here because it is different. In English it's different. It's different because they don't have milk. One has milk and the other one doesn't have milk. And let's see, what is the next one that we have there? We have chocolate. Do you like chocolate? Yes. 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 <laughs> okay. Who doesn't like chocolate? Me. You don't I like don't chocolate? I don't like no much. <laughs> no, not much. <laughs> not much. You know, it's funny. It's like ice cream snow. Uh, okay. <laughs> ice cream snow. <laughs> it is. It, that's why I told you. Es un nombre bien curioso. Or you can also call it fruit snow. Fruit snow. That it's only a nieve de frutas. Fruit snow. Uh, and that is the that is the name for a nieves. In English, fruit snow and ice cream, that it's the one that has milk. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. That's the difference. And we have yogurt, chips, gelatin, and nuts. Yogurt, do you like yogurt? Yes. No. Yes. No, you say you don't like yogurt. Chips are all the different <clears throat> types of churros and snacks, right? Quesito, tortillitos. All these things are chips. Right? Gelatin, it's, you know what gelatin is, right? Gelatina. Nuts, nueces, all the types of nuts. Todas las nueces. So mani. those are mani, mani salado, mani con dulce. Eh, ya parezco chapi. <laughs> lleve mani salado, mani con dulce, lleve, lleve, lleve. Candies. <laughs> candies are all the different types of candies, right? Popcorn, palomitas, and cookies, right? Cookies in general. Here we have for meat and proteins, carne y proteínas. We have the beans, the fish, the chicken, eggs, beef. Beef is carne de res, okay? Carne de res. Bacon, tocino. Do you like bacon? Yes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes, it's very delicious. Ribs, costillas, right? Costillas. Ham and sausages. Among. Jamón and sausages is salchichas. 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 Here we have fats, oils, and sugars. That are like grasas, aceites, y azúcares. Here we have honey, cream, uh, cream milk, butter. Butter is mantequilla, right? Oil, aceite, candies, dulces. It's also considered in this category. And cheese. And in the category of the grains, De los granos básicos. Here we have, let me just make this, move this a little bit. Here in the category of the grains, here I have rice, that it's uh, arroz. Arroz. arroz, rice, pasta, noodles, noodles, fideos, right? Crackers that are galletas saladas. Noodles que no eran los, los, fideos. los, fideos. Fideos. Ah, because pasta, the, poditos, tornillos, all this, all this. Pasta, it's all the spaghettis, the all the, the different things that we can have in pasta, right? Uh, thanks to COVID, I don't like pasta. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Because um, well, I really appreciate that I got food, right? Yo de veras agradezco el hecho que nos hayan dado comida en las, calzas, las cajas y las bolsas que dieron. 
But there was a, a lot of I I got yes. too. And, sigo esperando la, la mía. Hey, come on. Oh. No, ¿En serio? Yo no. <laughs> 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 yeah, ya ni la ando, Dan. <laughs> hey. No, but I, I got the food and it was good. I mean, the one that I got, I cannot complain. And it was very good. But there was a lot of pasta. A lot, a lot of pasta. Right? Creo que yeah, too. Yeah, creo que hice pasta con crema, pasta con salsa, Lots. pasta con pasta, pasta con vegetales. <laughs> I, I created pasta many pasta. different pasta, pasta con pasta. Con pasta. pasta. <laughs> but uh, yeah, now I, I don't like pasta it very much. Pasta. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so here we have noodles that are fideos, right? Crackers, bread, cereal. Cereal is all the different types, right? All the different types of cereal. <sighs> and the next one. For the food procedures, for the food procedures are the processes that you do when you cook food. These are verbs in this case, right? All these ones are verbs. And the first one that we have there is to cut. To cut is cortar. cortar. Peel. Pelar. Pelar, right? Pelar. Clean. Yeah. Limpiar. Yeah. Wash. Lavar. Lavar, right? Mix. Mezclar. 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 A slice is to cut Porción. in little. Rebarnar. Yes. No, no. Buy. Comprar. 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 Select. Hmm. Seleccionar. Seleccionar, right? It is very difficult with avocados, with coconuts, with watermelons. It's very difficult. <laughs> Bake. Hornear. Oil, mm -hmm. hervir, prepare, Para. preparar, fry, Freir. Freir. very good, toast, tostar, tostar. mash, aplastar, aplastar o hacer puré, right? machacar, the next one, chop, to cut in little pieces, right? For example, when you use the cilantro for the chirmol, you have to chop it in very, very little pieces, right? Chop, partir en pedazos pequeños, o triturar. Sí. Steer. Revolver. Batir o revolver, right? Okay. Here we have great. Rayar. 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 Steam, hervir, al vapor, right? Broil, well, steam is hervir. Broil is gra like sofreír o gratinar. Gratinar. And grill is a la parrilla. Parrilla. La parrilla. La parrilla. Sí. And the last category that we have here is the seafood. In the case of the ah. seafood, is all the food from the ocean, right? Toda esa comida que viene del mar. And in this one, we have anchovies are anchoas. Crab, cangrejo, lobster, langosta, langosta. langosta. octopus, pulpo, pulpo. pulpo. oyster, ostra. 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 ostra, right? And in here we can have uh, also the fish, we can have mm -hmm. the fish, the shelves, que son las conchas, the snail, Lops. Caracoles, squid, calamar, calamar. and shrimp, camarón. camarones. Okay, so you have your collection of vocabulary about food. Aquí el que se queja porque no le di vocabulario, come on. <laughs> You have a big collection of things. ¿Y por qué lo hago? A mí me gusta que mis alumnos tengan una variedad de cosas de las cuales hablar. No es, ¿cuál es tu favorite vegetable? Tomato, potato. No, you have a complete <laughs> list there. What is your favorite fruit? Apple. Apple. Banana. Oh. Watermelon. Orange. Right? Ah. You can have a complete variety there in uh, the collection of vocabulary. I am going to send you this one in a second. I am going to send you the document, okay? Teacher. For you to have it. Teacher. Then, yes? Repeat, please, uh, what is a snail? 
Snail, caracoles. Caracoles, okay. Caracoles. Snail. Okay, thank you. Like, like SpongeBob's pet. Como Garu. No, Gary. 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 Gary se llama el gato. Gary. Gary is the, the pet oh, of gosh. SpongeBob. So, here we have, and now that we have studied the different vocabulary about food, we are going to go to express your opinion about food. Here, let me just share the document with all of you. I'm going to look for it. And in here, we have different ways to express uh, your likes or dislikes about food. It says, I love, I love is something that you can eat all the time, every day, and you just love it, right? Something that it's like the best thing for you. You can say, teacher, I love pizza. And pizza can be for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. And you just love it, right? Or you say, teacher, I love pupusas. And it can be for breakfast, for lunch, for dinner, all the time. And you love pupusas, right? I like. It's like, yeah, me lo como. No, es mi favorito, pero ah, I like it. I don't like. It's something that, hmm, me lo como. No me mata, pero no me gusta, right? I hate is something that you cannot eat at all. Something that you just can't stand. Something that you cannot eat. For example, in my case, it will be pacaya. Pacaya. I hate pacaya. It's one of the things that I really, 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 really hate. I sent you the document to your WhatsApp. Yo creo que ya lo tienen todos. Okay. Oh, well, people, the isote flower is a national symbol. <laughs> Don't eat the national symbols. Do you eat the torogoses? <laughs> All right. Yes. This no. <laughs> no, right. We don't. When I have a. When, when I was a kid. <laughs> when I was a kid. When, when I was a kid, I. A hunt a trogos, and we eat it. Oh my goodness, even Kiara lo desaprueba. <laughs> Pero una pata with, de trogos. With rice. <laughs> with rice, yes. Imagine. Like a, a rice, o sea, arroz aguado. Uh, wet rice. Wet rice. Oh my God. Pur torogos. Pur torogos. Imagine. No. Depredación de fauna. <laughs> este, aló, sí. Buenas. <laughs> Greenpeace. <laughs> okay, good. Hey, uh, I don't know what has happened with your cameras, but I cannot see you. And I need to see you to see the reaction of your phrases. You are going to use the different vocabulary here. I have here, I love, I like, I don't like, I hate. And uh, these are the fourth that we're going to use. I love, I like, I don't like, and I hate. Give me one uh, of each of them using the vocabulary about food, okay? You can say, I love pupusas, I like tacos, I don't like uh, ice cream, and I hate pacaya. Ew. It's like, I, I don't like it. Give me your uh, categories for each of these sentences. Do you need to use the vocabulary? Uh, you have it on the WhatsApp, or if not, I am going to share it uh, to you. I don't know if you can see my screen. No, right? Uh, teacher, por Dios. Por eso no me enamoré, ya ven. <laughs> there you go. Now you can see the screen. Okay. Y no me dicen ustedes. There you go. Can you see the categories? Yeah. I love, I like, I don't like, I hate. Those are the four categories yeah. that we're going to use. I need you to use 
a food vocabulary to complement these sentences. You can say, I love watermelon. I like chicken. I do not like uh, burritos. I hate uh, isote flour. That's one example. I gave you two okay. of my examples. Hi, I love, yes, I love golden apple. Mm -hmm. I like mm, potato. Good. And pizza and tacos and burritos. I don't like a, I don't like give me a moment. I don't like what is something that you don't like? Uh, 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 give me a moment. I I find I don't like a snail. Snail, uh huh. I hate uh, shelves. You hate shelves. Good. So those yeah. are your examples. Very good, Heidi. Excellent job. Who's Very next? Chill. Shells. Uh, conchas. Conchas. And how do you say ostras? Oyster. 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 Okay. Oyster. Oyster. Uh, yeah, but I, I don't know why. Similar. People... Es el tamaño. Yeah, it's bigger, mm -hmm. right? The oysters are bigger and the shells are small. But why do people eat, I mean, live animals? They still move. It's like, don't eat me. And you're like, hey. <laughs> Sorry, bro. Yeah, it's like, no. El mismo animal está diciendo que no lo coma. Sorry. It's like. No. That's really horrible. Poor, poor oh. animals. Poor animals. Hello, Marvin. We didn't see your camera. What happened? Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> Estaban cambiando. <laughs> Es que mucho calor desde andaba ahí en paños menores. Ok, Angélica, give me your example. I love the nachos. I eat every day. <laughs> with meat, with avocado, with... Oh. Good, very good. Cheese. With beans. Bean, cheese. With beans. Yeah. Okay, so you yeah. love you love nachos. You like what? Yes. I like some berries. Strawberries, good. I I don't like um um sorry. um spinach. Spinach, uh huh. I don't like. I hate um is the flower. It's not the flower. That's very good. It's a national yeah. symbol. Don't eat it. <laughs> <laughs> good. Yeah. Tell me, Gustavo, what are your categories? Okay. Uh, I love pizza. I like grapes. I don't like celery. Good. I hate oyster. Oysters. Good. Oyster. Good. Celery. Okay. Apio. Apio. Uh, apio. <laughs> no. I you see, if, if I he... eat, but I don't like. Uh -huh. <laughs> so if he goes, ah, pero una cosa es que no te, o sea, no te gusta que no te la comes. <laughs> no, but in this case, when you say I don't ah. like, it's like, uh, well, if if you have to eat it, you eat it, but you don't like it, right? Si vas a una casa y te ofrecen apio, por ejemplo, es como, thank you very much. Mm. Mm. A little bit. It's like, do you want more? No, thank you. I'm full. Maybe you're... Maybe. Mm. Mm, another one. I love you, mother in law. I love you. Let's see. Uh, Mr. Marvin, can you give me your categories? Uh, I love tangerine. Tangerines, yay. I like bees. I do not like snails. Yeah. 
Yeah, I hate mm. pagkaya. Ah, you hate pagkaya. Me too. Mm. <laughs> That makes two of us. <laughs> Mr. Luis Gonzalez, tell me your categories. I love watermelon. Very good. I like pizza and good. chicken. Pizza and chicken. I, I don't like uh, octopus and squid. Uh, octopus, pulpo. Uh, no. Uh, I hate fresh fish. You ah. hate fried fish. Fresh fish. Ah, fresh fish, el pescado fresco. Uh, I don't like. The I smell, hate. the smell or the flavor? The smell. Ah, but you eat fish. <laughs> Pero ya frito te lo come. Uh, no. <laughs> no. No. Okay. Good. <laughs> <laughs> he hates fish, okay. right? That's a, that's new for me. That's new for me. I hate covered fish, the one that you eat for Holy Week. Uh, the the covered like. fish. Uh, yeah. I, don't like. I don't like. No. So Fridays. Uh huh. This is fish with air. No, it's called. It's not covered fish. fish. Yeah. It's called cover fish. Cover fish because it's perforado. But Luis yeah. hates the fresh fish. It's like ew. Y ningún tipo de pescado, Luis. All fish. Uh, so, um, someone, I don't know. Some, some of them. Yeah. And the tuna? El atún? Sushi. No, I don't like. You don't like sushi? I don't like, uh, I don't like atún. I don't like tuna. Oh my God. Me I too. like I don't like tuna. <laughs> Me too about um, la cuarentena. Yeah, the, 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 the quarantine. quarantine. Uh, Another one. It's yeah, cat like, and dogs. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yo tengo, tengo un amigo que dice que es comida de gato. <laughs> and I am like, hey! No, pero yo... Uh, ya preparado, ya con pepino, con apio, con limón, mayonesa y todas las cosas. It's, it changes, but... It's not that favorite. Mr. Ivan, what are your categories? Um, I love apple. Mm -hmm. I like the drink of carao. Carao? Carao, yeah. You like the carao yeah. drink? Yeah, yeah. carao, carao <laughs> with milk. Oh, no. carao with I don't like it. It's very good. I don't like it. Okay, you like carao, very good. I don't like uh, pacaya. Good. You are on my team. And I, you hate? I hate uh, salad uh, meat, o sea, carne salada. Ah, salty. Salty meat. Salty. Okay. Yeah, salty meat. Uh, no, no, no. I don't like salty meat. Good. Very good. Uh, Hazel, can you give me your categories? Um, I love pizza. Good. <laughs> um, I like apples. I don't like um, pacayas, cusucos. <laughs> no, we're the Salvadorian animals, people. <laughs> Hello, sí. Um, I had locus. <laughs> what? Langosta? Ah, Lois. Lobster. 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 Love. Lobster. Loves. Lobster. Yeah. Yo, Lobster. Odio, yo odio la langosta porque no le proba. <laughs> yeah, Muchos muy tentáculos. <laughs> la langosta no tiene tentáculos. Los tentáculos del pulpo. It's the, the octopus. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Mr. Mario, what are your categories? Yeah, it's the same. Mr. Mario, tell me your categories. Yeah. I love pineapple. Uh -huh. I like cream cocktail. Uh -huh. I don't I don't like celery. You don't like celery? Good. No. Because, because I hate celery diet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all the yeah. all the things about diets, it's celery. Yeah. And let me see. And... And... I think it's just that one. Do you, do you hate celery, right? Ah, yeah. I, I hate eggplant. Eggplant, too. Yeah, good. 
It was like, nah, I don't like it either. Mr. Elmer, go ahead. Okay, I love pupusas. Uh -huh. I like fruit. I hate garlic. <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't like eggplants. You don't like eggplants. And Carlita Rodriguez. No, se me volvió a perder. <laughs> Carlita se me pierde justo en el momento que le pregunto. <laughs> okay, so we are going to continue practicing this uh, on Monday. So practice the vocabulary because you are going to use it. And I wish you to have a fantastic weekend. Rest a lot. And I'm going to see you on Monday for the next class. Okay, practice your vocabulary, students. Have a beautiful night and have a beautiful week. See you on Monday. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank bye you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye, my dear students. Bye. 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 Bye